Okay, so I got a Discord message from Psycho the other night with a screenshot of NRN on NameMC and he was freaking out. I looked at the screenshot and sure enough, it was weird. NRN wanted to change their capitalization, so they changed their name and they were going to wait 30 days and then change it back to a different capitalization of NRN, probably lowercase or whatever. But a little over 10 hours later, somebody else took the name, even though it wasn't available. This shouldn't have been possible, and I immediately started trying to figure out how it worked. i got gotten a few DMs in the past month from people who changed their names and then had the same thing happen to them, but I didn't really think much of it, and I thought it must have had something to do with Mojang support, but this time I had a different idea. NRN was a recent gift card snipe, which means it was on a Microsoft account, because any Minecraft account created after December 1st, 2020 is automatically a Microsoft account. I was convinced it somehow had to do with Microsoft accounts, so I got on my computer and I started trying to change my name to upcoming names that looked like they were from new accounts. I had no success, but the next morning I got a bunch of messages from my friends about Monarch being transferred instantly and I knew I must have been missing something the night before. Turns out all you had to do was change the capitalization, so that really shows how simple these methods can be sometimes. This video isn't going to be super organized or anything, I just kind of threw it together, but I interview NX, the guy that insta-transferred Monarch, and I show you how to find these names in the wild. First, let's get to the interview with NX. I guess just like go over kind of like what the thought process, how you, how you figured out the, the method and then how it works. Yeah, so the morning of when I got Monarch, before I got it, my friend Lucky Sweet DM'd me, right? Because yeah. we were talking about NRN the night before and he was like, hey, maybe you should try name changing your Microsoft account, right? Mm -hmm. uh, so when I did that, right, like initially it wasn't successful, right? And I kind of gave up, right? Mm -hmm. But then about 30 minutes later, I tried like deleting the Microsoft account and claiming it again. And that time when I happened to claim it again, I did different caps, right? Okay. So at first I thought it might've been a deletion method, right? But then after I tried it again with dead, right? Me and dead, we did header, which was like the second one, I guess. Yeah. That's when we figured out it wasn't a deletion method. The caps had to be different. It, that was the night that NRN got changed. Yeah, um, like this is this is all things to NRN too. If that man didn't try to change his caps or whatever. Okay, so that was our little quick interview with NX, kind of explaining how he figured it out and a little bit of how it works. And now let's get to me talking about it and taking a couple names. All right, so I apologize if you can hear my background sound. There's some cars going by because my window is open and I don't really feel like getting up and closing it. So this is related to the whole Microsoft account. Um, Thing with where you can take the name that's available or that isn't available so I was just looking at name MC and I kind of went through names that were upcoming that I thought were kind of cool um, like temp mail I think that's cool I mean it's like of course it's not really worth that much and same with hell world but I think hell world's cool because I think hell world is just kind of a word that's been associated with minecraft and the nether for a while um, I guess you don't really hear much of it anymore but you know back eight nine ten years ago it was pretty common either way they're both cool names and I'm going to try to change my name to them. As you can see, I'm logged into my account facts in a box. Now, if I type in hell world, you'll see that the profile name already exists. But if I change one of the letters, it's available. And that's because this account, I was looking through it. Like when I went through all the names, I opened up probably like 30 tabs and I kind of like, I don't know, I think I set it to like 15 searches at least. And I just kind of like went through the names that were coming up and I just, uh, I mean, I didn't check every single one, I just checked the ones that I thought were kind of cool. And, and I opened them all up and looked if any were like clearly created before December 1st, 2020. So I looked at this account and you can see that its first name change was February 14th and it was well to hell world and then it changed to something else. But I was like, okay, so it's possible this account was created after December 1st. And so I went over here and I checked and sure enough, the name is available. So I'm actually going to leave that for you guys because I don't really want it. Um, I just thought it was a cool name. So one of you guys can take that. Just make sure to change the capitalization on it. Now, the same thing happened with temp mail. Let me just show you. Like, type in temp mail, all lowercase, nothing happens. It's a, it already exists. But if you change the T to an uppercase T, it's available. Now, this doesn't work. Again, this doesn't work with every account. It only works with the ones that are Microsoft accounts. Um... So I guess we'll kind of see what happens with that when migration becomes a thing, which it's possible that it'll be in like a week on the 12th. Today, I'm when I'm recording this, it's the 5th of April and Mojang, when they like slipped up and let out the dates, uh, it was the 12th that migration was happening. So if you migrate your account, um, don't change your name unless you don't care about your name. So I'm just going to prove to you, I'm going to take temp mail right now and we'll just reload. Like as you can see, it, like it was going to be available on the 24th. Eight in 18 days and I just reload because I just took it and you can see I just took the name of my account and so you can do the same thing with 
hell world if you want i'm just gonna leave it for one of you guys to claim so if you're early congratulations enjoy having the name hell world also if you go through the upcoming names and you find some that are cool and you end up taking them even though they haven't dropped yet let me know in the comments or message me on discord or something i think it's pretty cool that we have this whole i guess exploit or whatever mo just a mistake on mojang's part but it's a pretty cool thing that's going on and i think we should take advantage of it while we can I'm not sure if any of this is going to be reverted by Mojang. It's possible, but it's also possible that they won't. If you look at the dupes that were created in December, yes, they reverted those. But I feel like this is different, doesn't cause as much of a problem. Like, it just kind of pisses some people off. And Mojang, their support system, they don't seem to really care if people are that pissed off. So, I think it's likely that not all of these will be reverted. Okay, that's all I have for you. Thanks for watching. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's up, if it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, then it's up, then it's up, then it's stuck. I can make the party hot. I can make your body rock.